If you live in Evanston, Wyoming and you're a cable TV subscriber and you have a black remote control like this with a black set-top box or a DVR and you have a widescreen TV and you get the square box on it, there are things you can do to fix this. There's a hidden menu that you can access. The problem here is you have to know that you're telling your cable box to turn off. You turn your cable box off before you do the following. And you have a short window that you can access this menu. So you have to tell the remote control that you're talking to the cable box, not to the TV. If the TV button is illuminated and you press the power button, your TV will shut off. When your TV shuts off, your cable box stays on unless you tell the remote control to turn off the cable box. Of course, I have mine set up to display the time, so if you'll notice, there are no little lights on either side of the time clock. When the cable box comes on, those lights come on and they remain on on the sides of the channel number or the time, whatever it is that you do. So, back to hidden menus. We have closed captioning situations and we have screen fit situations. With this video, I'm going to show you how to adjust the screen fit situation. You take it and you tell your remote control that you want to operate the cable box. Turn off the cable box and then press this menu button. The menu button will tell the box to go into the hidden menu that you can make adjustments to. For closed captioning, you change this. For the screen fit, the closest thing you're going to get is stretch. If you don't subscribe to HD channels, most of your standard digital channels are in square format. By changing this to stretch, your 4 to 3 override ratio, you have HDMI, which is your HDMI output primary, and you have 4 to 3 override stretch. You can change either of these, and if you change it too much, the screen may go black. Give it a second, let it catch up, it should come back on. I am going to put mine to stretch, and we're going to go back to that channel that we were watching. Doesn't help when it's a commercial. But if you can see that that's a, from screen side, from screen edge to screen edge. And if I can power this down and make the change quick enough, then we come back to the commercial. Different commercial. Let's see. Power, menu, 4 to 3 override, let's change that to stretch. Stretch, power down, power on, and we now fit the screen a little bit bigger. It's kind of nice. Okay. There might be, you might notice that some focal points on some different programming may have people in different sizes, and you also may notice that some of the black bars still exist, but they are not quite as big. This is a good feature for you to adjust on your own. Feel free. Thank you.